Starting soon, starting soon. We have no time. We have a J. WM, Baba, Rally, Attila Taketa going on against Zenobia. Let's just jump in into the action. Welcome, everyone. Just uh, let's get it started slowly. Let the people join. Welcome, everyone. I have no idea, but I think Baba had no sleep yet. I think he he played all night through. And uh, before we going into the finals, which will be in about, let me check, should be around 20, 22 minutes. We can take a look on JWM as also Lost Kingdom 105. Let's get a fast update going. Yeah, 105 is crazy. <laughs> Some energy drink for me. And looks like this, Zenobia isn't doing well. Welcome everyone. And there we have 39. Fighting again, 60 on the right side. And how are you guys doing today? One thing is for sure, today there will be a lot of action. It's going to be hot because OV just needs one more one more win and they will be the final winner of those uh, grand finals. 39 has to give all. I hope uh, they learned something from the last match. Let's hope at least they're going to grab one arc. Because they have to. Okay, let's take a fast look on uh, JWM territory. This is San Pedro. Ansem KVK. You can see the JWM Fort 139 did pretty well, I have to say. I expected them to vanish, but they're still here. They're still here. So, GG to that. Their fort is not burning. JWM's fort is burning. I mean, what's going on here? Well, that doesn't mean much, okay? Because let's compare the HP and the JWM fort looks better than uh, the 139 one. And we can see a new flag being built over here. I cannot see any rally. And 193 fort is burning. All right, I think this uh, zone is getting interesting later. Meanwhile, let's take a look on uh, Lost Kingdom 105. Oh boy, Kingdom 60 <laughs> still uh, have troops available. They pushing on this pass here in uh, Maka or Macha or whatever the name is. So this is a uh, bottom pass. This is a right pass. Let's see what's going on here. And oh yeah, we have action. This is 46. 46 still alive. That's good to see. That's good to see. I Oh my. Oh damn. I mean, how much action can there be anymore? I don't know. It's fighting for days now. <laughs> it's uh, They have been fighting for days now. Let's uh, look at the map. Okay, bottom right, Kingdom 60. A lot of red flags and yep, looks like Sakaka is their zone together with 41 in uh, Cyan. Let's take a look at uh, 
Dimbokro? How does Dimbokro look like? Yeah, I can see plenty forts of 60. They're going to burn 55 right now. I don't even have to check. Yeah, you can see here. 55 getting burned bottom. Then we have 46 fort also getting burned. No, it's okay. It's not burning right now. And 41 and 77 pushing very hard to the left. They reach the TOG fort of 46 here. And looks like... Oh, a lot of marches over here. That's activity. The fort is burning and oil troops trying to... Uh, trying to not let the opponent teleport on this spot. 39 fort. 39 fort is burning. Well, if I have to make a guess for Dimbokro, it doesn't look too good, to be honest. But how about Maka? Can they at least defend Maka? Because if they also lose this zone, oh boy. Damn, and 51. Let's check. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. 51 managed to break out even more. Now, that's interesting. This is a very good time because 39 is very... It's very busy uh, <laughs> fighting against 60. So, if there is a good time. Well, it's now. 51 joining the party soon. Yeah, that's it for now. We're gonna keep our second cam on this spot over here. Looks kind of interesting. 39 against 60. Some skirmish going on. And let's check back to JWM meanwhile. Welcome everyone to the live stream. Glory Montana, hello. Remet Abadi, welcome. Who is the champion Fleisch? Uh, V36 or OV? Well, I believe OV has a benefit of uh, commander knowledge. They have experience in using those commanders. Heard of worship? The champ is Fleisch for sure. Look at his face. Thank you very much. Mr. Smoke Turkey, that Attila probably buffed out of its mind. Oh yeah. Baba has some good equipment going. Winstar, welcome. Itachi. Yeah, 105 doesn't want to end. And uh, Batza, also welcome to the stream. Just Lipo, Malzeit, herzlich willkommen. 15 minutes to go for the finals to start. And my bets are all in for 36 because uh, it's smart to uh, bet on the underdog. If you win, you're going uh, to get a huge amount of coins. Redsbury, Jesus, I forgot to bet. Well, that's not good. Lilian, OV advantage is not the commander knowledge. They are winning all middle fights because of better coordination. Yeah, well, I, I think many stuff, many things are coming together. But they have more experience. It's just a fact. They are in an early kingdom. Which means they had opportunity to test all these combinations. But still, 39 is, uh, uh, 36 is, it's not bad. In terms of points per minute, they, they did an amazing score last arc, to be honest. But at least they need one arc. And I hope they realized, referring to the first game we casted. Well, today is now or never, right? 3-6 has to win. Because uh, if they lose, OV is the final winner. Because they have two points and this is a points game. Now, in order for 36 to win, they have to get two points. So they have to win this match and the next one. And Baba still snacking on this uh, Zenobia. Looks like 46 are out of resources. To be honest, I think everyone is like <laughs> out of resources. 
I have no idea how 60 can keep fighting. They train a lot together from what I understand. Lim Ben, is it worth to migrate to Old Kingdom for new commander like YSS and back to Old Kingdom for KPK3? It can make sense. Eberic, hallo, viel Spaß im Post. Danke. Schnapp dir was zu trinken und dann äh, gleichfalls. I go for OV. Yeah, the problem on betting on OV is if they win, well, you're not getting too, ma uh, too much coins as a benefit. That's why... Even there's low chance for the underdog, it can make sense to bet on the underdog, which is 36 probably here. Hey, um, Ark of Osiris have broken a rating. Yes, I heard about it. I heard about the fact that uh, Ansem buffs are applied in Ark of Osiris, something like that. And there has been a fix today. I think there was uh, 30 minutes downtime. Something like that, so I believe they put a fix. We're gonna see. You can easily check it by 400k marches, I believe. And let's check the timers. 12 minutes to go here. And uh, welcome everyone to the stream. And I'm going to prepare myself, getting some information about uh, the Ark of Osiris skills. So I'm going to try to tell you everything which is going on on the field. Those skills being fired in the middle are very crucial. Especially fight to the death. Yeah, most uh, used skills and the uh, most important are Div Divine Aid for adding five te uh, teleports at the beginning of the match. Very important. Mystical Formation, 50% defense, who's in an area for three minutes. Running Charge, which is giving 100% walking speed for 30 seconds. Very important if uh, your Alliance member manages to grab the Ark, you want him to be as fast as possible. Tear down, Ark structures getting 80% more damage for 5 minutes. To the death, 100% damage increase and a 30% damage reduction for 1 minute. Also War Drums, attack 80% for 3 minutes. Those are the most used skills. Let's uh, try to keep track on those. Ramit Abadi, by the way, I heard you work at NASA. Yes, and I'm from the future. Tagalog is what we're This is the language of the Philippines. It's one of the many languages. There also is Visaya and some several other dialects. And looks like this Zenobia is not doing too bad here. And let's check the timer. Nine minutes to go for the finals to start. Ladies and gentlemen, this will be a very exciting game. Snip TV. Today we zeroed a 166 M power to 88 million. Not bad and not easy to do. Zenobia failed. Looks like the flag is burning. And I have to say, 39 is performing pretty well here. 
I mean, their flags are still here. Their fort is still here. The HP is fine. It's not burning right now. How about JVM? Okay. I can see some flames. They having some barbecue over here. But uh, both alliances are active. Glory Montana. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Um, I cannot get the report here right now on my very mini account. Well, I can try something. Let me send my coordinates to Baba. He has to send me uh, the chat log. Yep, I texted him. Let's see if we can get a hand on this report. Now, if you're creating a, a small farm account, you cannot text unless you reached level 7 or something like that. Yeah, this is a problem now. This is a problem now. But, uh... We're going to use a little trick here. Hola, hola amigo. So dame por favor. Pabor. Welcome. You are lazy. Well, there is a trick to get rid of the fog, but when I'm streaming it is a problem. I cannot just reconnect, otherwise it will also cut the connection to uh, the live stream or to my PC. So we're going to use a little different trick here. Oh no, what happened? Wait, what happened here? Damn, the fog has been gone. Well, now you know how to do it. And let's go back to this position. This one is kind of interesting right now. Looks like this flag is a target. And let's keep track on the timer. Five minutes to go. Yep. Uh, three minutes before it's going to start, we're going to change our accounts. Okay. And welcome everyone to the live stream. Relog in to fix it. Yeah, I can not just relog in, but we, we tricked. We triggered a relog without closing the game or the connection. And still a lot of Kingdom 60 troops here. And I think slowly we can uh, change our accounts over here. Let me just for some seconds disable the screen. And we are back. I'm waiting for John Wick action. I'm pretty sure we're going to see John Wick. 
He is the fastest arc carrier out there. And we are back to our main account. Let's open this free stuff over here. Some free goodies. Always welcome. And I believe it's about three minutes till the finals are going to start. Yeah, three minutes to go. Going to switch to our main screen here. I'm going to keep the second screen onto the middle so we can have a track on who's going into the middle first. Crucial information. Avi, I bet everything on the underdog. That is a smart thing to do, I did the same. Heard of Warship, Fleisch. It's an epic commander. They said, Watashi, who do you think it is? I don't understand. Shashi Gaming, hello Fleisch, how are you bro? I'm fine, how about you? Charles, welcome, thank you. And two minutes to go. Fly, check out uh, Last Kingdom 105. 36 using farms to block flags. Yeah, after the finals match. What happened to JWM? They, well, they are fi fighting. And we're going to have a small change here. Blend out the map. Okay, we are good to go. We are good to go. Twenty seconds to go. JWM will fight if Baba fight. Well, I think they're also going to fight without Baba if he's offline. Ten seconds. And go, show me the button, show me the button, come on. Do we have to trigger it again? Maybe, let's see. Yep. We have to trigger it again and boom, let's enter. All right, Temple of Osiris going to be fixed here. Oh, by the way, there was... We have to return, we have to return. We have to change something in the settings, I believe. Boom. Boom. And let's check back. I hope this helps, I hope this helps. Also going to do the same here. Let's change the settings. No, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Simplified graphics. Okay, it's activated. Boom, boom, and let's go back. Okay, I think we can even see everything on... Uh, without simplified graphics. Should be fine now. 
and we're going to put our cam here in the middle. This is uh, what we want to see. Okay. We are good to go, I think. Let's see if we are going to switch into simplified. I hope not. And on the bottom we have 36. Peter. At the top, 120 million. Brad. Marple. Most likely those uh, have a title. And let's check the other cities. I can see a lot of 100 million. 240 million. Yep. And on the OV side. Slody. Ace. And the well known John Vick. Okay. A lot of power here. And looks like they are complete. One is missing. Okay, 10 seconds to go and we're most likely going to see T1 marches on the field. Why we are going to see T1? First of all, T1 is fast and second reason, the more T1 you smash at the beginning, the more energy you can generate. And energy is being used to fire skills, which are most important in the middle. You want to increase attack, you want to increase your defense. So. Let's smash that T1. And most likely we're also going to see a T1 rally to the obelisk to smash those T1 troops generating energy. John Wick, Chow Chow, or CC, or however you want to call him. Yeah, this is all T1. This is T4, well you can see on the color. Meanwhile, we can switch back to our main screen here. And I guess 36 is doing the same, uh, the same strategy here using T1s. And please, 36, please, at least get one arc. I beg you. I beg you. And they're grabbing some outposts here. Now I can see 36 managed to... No, they have not managed to get the obelisk. First, let's take a look on who is able to get the first obelisk over here. And OV managed to get the bottom left one. All right, the bottom right one, excuse the top right one, also has been grabbed by 36. And welcome everyone to this live stream. The second match of the finals, 36 has to win, otherwise they are gone and out and OV will be the final winner. I hope 36 watched their last match and they learned from their mistakes. So let's just fix it 10 minutes for the arc to spawn. I believe at around 5 minutes we're going to see the first marches going into the middle. I believe OV will try to push as early as possible. Kinda using the, stra uh, the same strategy they used in the first game. And let's take a look here. We have 30 against 30 so it's complete and right now points wise there is nothing yet the first structures being opened are the obelisks once they open everyone can teleport in 216 120 130 and this should be the fastest one over here about one minute 
And there is a T1 rally, as I told you, they want to smash the T1 troops, generating energy to launch uh, this alliance skills. And this rally is not intended to uh, do anything, they just want to sacrifice his troops. Yeah, I think we're going to see the same thing over here. Also here, yeah, you see swarming with uh, T1 troops. And is this a marksman in the obelisk? Oh my gosh, will they? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, will OV be able to get this obelisk over here? No, I think uh, 36 has enough troops in there, but. Uh, it's yellow. It's yellow. And the points started to get counted. We have 300 against 200. 300 against 300 now. And let's see how 36 will manage to get their points per minute game running. On the first match, 36 managed to get more points per minute than OV. But I have to say, OV, OV strategy was uh, made for the for grabbing all the arcs, so of course their points per minute game can be a little bit uh, less. And the first city is porting in. Slody, Pedro, Old Chen. And another guy, I cannot spell those Chinese names, but they are there. And let's uh, check for the structures while keeping an eye on the middle. And as you can see here, we... Uh, Seeing the first OV troops going through or to the middle. Maybe they want to push a battle line to the front. And we can see a Saladin trying to do some damage here. It's nothing special. Let's take a look on rallies. Slowly has a rally going on the Shrine of War. Ace, Desert Altar. And the Desert Altar is getting swamped, but it's fine. And this time we can see battle reports. Finally, last, last finals we w haven't been able to. That's a uh, good news for us. So we can keep track on uh, how those fights are going. We have Artemisia and Nebu. This is interesting. From 36 against Saladin Mulan. Okay, this is just a march swarming. Just for debuffing purpose. And let's keep track on the rallies. Those are marching. Slowly wants Co RLD. And uh, Pina Bunny is doing a rally against the Shrine of Life. Meanwhile, five minutes for the Ark to spawn. Let's see which troops are going there first. I can see some movement from the OV side. Yep, as I told you, five minutes around. They're going to try to push here early, but 36 learned. They learned. And they mobilizing some troops over here. Now 36, let me tell you, push forward. Don't stay there. Try to be in a group. And uh, I think they have to start fighting more early this time. So this definitely is going to be interesting to see here. And we can see one rally, which is uh, Ramses against Zenobia. But Zenobia is doing fine. That's not prob no problem here for the Zenobia. Another rally again. We, we're seeing Zenobia in the garrison. Right now this is a meta. Ramses. Nope. It's not going to su uh, succeed.
and slow the. Meanwhile, let's take a look in the middle. Oh, we have the split screen. This is great, so we can see everything going on here right now. Yeah, we can keep track. That's good. No caps, please. Oh, that's nice. Our chatbot is still active. Oh, Demo, like you are here. Thanks. Please take care on the chat because I deactivated uh, our chatbot. So you have to do uh, some work now. And welcome to the stream. Uh, hey, Flash, can I chat and action back? Oh, uh, yes. Do you mind the chat in the middle or what? Ah, this one. Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. My mistake. Yep, yep, yep. I'm going to remove it. Wait, one moment. Give me one moment. I'm going to remove the top uh, chat and action. There we go. Okay, got it, got it. Now it's better. Let's check. Same thing over here. Let me remove it. And boom. Okay, there we go. Looks fine to me. Sorry for that, you couldn't see the points. I apologize. And let's take a look in the middle. Two minutes to go for the arc to spawn and what is going on here? We also have to fix something on the overlay here. Just taking us 10 seconds. And moving down, done. Okay, we got it, we got it. Now this time it looks much better. For 36 and we're going to wait for the first skills being launched over here one minute to go one minute to go which kind of skills are going to be fired here? Now I have to say 36 troops are not many here. Still some are arriving, but uh, if this is all, if this is all 36 wants to give into the middle, I'm not sure. And they have to go in now. 36, you have to go in now. Fire your skills. Otherwise you will have no time to grab the arc. If OV is smart, they're going in now. OV, go in. And they added five teleports. Well, that's not what I want to see. Mystical formation, defense up, war drums, attack up. And uh, the same for 36, defense up. Now you can see the blue circle is defense and the red circle is attack. And they started to smash. Now third, five seconds for the arc to spawn. 36 has to push forward. They need to move the battle line to the OV side because if OV manages to grab the arc they have to deny the OV carrier and they can only deny the arc carrier which most likely will be John Wick if they are at this position right so they have to push forward push the battle line forward onto OV for a little bit so you can grab the arc and also kill the arc carrier And the control of the arc has been lost right now. Someone is grabbing it. Both alliances, OV and uh, 36, they have their skills active. And OV captured the arc. Arc carrier down. Now we can keep track on the sad faces over here. Points wise, 
5,500 for OV and 6,300 for 36. Again, the points per minute game is uh, working good for 36, but they have to get one arc at least. Let's see if they can manage to grab it. And it doesn't look good for 36. Look at all those sad faces. Oh boy, that's not good. That's not good at all. And color-wise, I can only see blue, and blue is OV, and this most likely means the first arc, which is giving 3,000 points, is going to OV. Now, I don't think it is part of OV's strategy to keep the arc, because points per minute-wise, 36 is doing great. They have to rely on grabbing those arcs, so most likely, likely they are not going to wait or delay. And yeah, look, <laughs> we are only seeing blue right now. Only blue. Only blue colors. And... Uh, yeah, they just have to deliver, deliver now. Easy task. Let's uh, move our second camp to the middle again. And I have to try to fix something over here again. Give me uh, 30 seconds, I have to fix something here. Yeah, something was wrong with the overlay, but here we don't uh, need to see the points. Which means we can keep it like that. Yep. And we're going to change back to the other fuse. Let's make sure they are fine. Looks good. Looks good. Okay, we are good to go. And by the way, welcome everyone to this live stream. We're seeing the finals. First arc is going to OV. This was very easy for OV, I have to say. I mean, we had uh, one or two minutes fighting and then uh, a lot of sad faces from 36. Meanwhile, let's see where OV is going. they going to assist in uh, getting this Desert Altar defended by Zenobia. And let's take a look on those reports. Okay, these are swarms. Guan Leonidas, no problem for Zenobia. How about this one? Oh, Nebuchadnezzar Ramses, can you see this? Ladies and gentlemen, take a look. Okay, let me do like this, sorry for the screen. It's hard to see right now. But uh, power-wise, we have 1.8 million against 700,000. So, Nebuchadnezzar and Ramses is doing pretty well in Ark of Osiris. This is a secret uh, secret combination. Also, Nebuchadnezzar paired with YSG is doing pretty fine. By the way, make sure to drop a like and subscribe on this video. Very appreciated. Let's go into the split screen again. And the Ark still has not been delivered. Points wise, we can see 7000 for OV against 9700 for 36. So, again, we're going to see a points per minute advantage for 36. But this is not enough. 36 knows on the first game they have to get at least one arc. So, let's see if they're going to be more smart on this game. They have to, otherwise, they are out of the finals. Let me try to... Uh... Yeah, I'm sorry for the screen right now. There's not much space for you to see the report. But I can fix it very fast. Give me uh, just a second. 
Boom. And this is Zenobia. This is Ramses. No, this is a wrong combination. And let me check the correct one. We want to see Nebuchadnezzar and uh, Ramses. This is Ramses El Cid. Alright. There it is. Now you can see it. 1.8 million against 700,000. Zenobia Theodora against Nebuchadnezzar Ramses. And this is a very good counter to Zenobia, at least in Ark of Osiris. So keep it in mind, Ark of Osiris means 200% attack. So this can have a change on a rally, of course. And... Yeah, we're going to deactivate the donations right now. We have a little bit more screen space over here. Let's check on the Shrine of War. We have plenty of marches from OV side. Swarming the Shrine of Life again. Of course. 36 Zenobia in garrison. And let's see if those marches are enough to bring down this Zenobia in the 36 Shrine of War. At the same time. Shrine of Life. This is fine, no problem. This is fine, no problem. Looks good good to me oh is this yeah it looks fine shrine of life and sky altar we have a ramses rally going on the sky altar but i can see reinforcements going in 36 managed to defend and uh, ov delivered the arc by the way points are looking the same 11,400 on both sides so they points wise they are even okay they are even right now but this won't be enough for uh, 36 at least get one arc 36 please let me check the chat and welcome everyone I will donate if Fly show us his legs on stream. The first thing I'm going to reveal on cam is my butt. My booty. Now let's be serious. Uh, at around 50k, I think we're going to see a face reveal. Because 10k, come on, this is nothing too special. This is nothing too special and let's... Uh, Take a look on Sky Altar over here. And I don't need to tell you which kind of garrison we can see here, but let's try to try to get some battle reports. Zenobia, Theodora, Ramses, Nebuchadnezzar now. This one wasn't so good. Same here. And this sky altar looks okay to me. I cannot see the HP. Okay, there we go. And the imposter, thank you very much for becoming level 1 member. And let me give something to you in return. This is for you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. And meanwhile, oh, something interesting is happening here. Let's take a look on 36, they're moving early into the middle. Is this the arc they want to get? Is this the arc they decided to go for? Are we going to see an early opening, an early match here? 36 absolutely needs some more marches. Let's look and oh yeah, we're going to see some more 
This looks pretty good. This is going to be a huge fight. Let's be serious. Let's be serious. Now they have to wait to get a group together for this uh, arc skills to being fired because those skills are area based. So they first have to gather. And I'm not sure if they should push to this position. Also OV is mobilizing. We're going to use the first screen here. And I believe we can even make it like that. Let's see. Just keeping track on uh, OV's reinforcements. Oh boy, this is going to be a huge fight. And now we have, we can see a lot of troops of 36. Let's see if they have the power. Let's see if they have the power. And these are a lot of troops, a lot of troops. I can tell you, everyone is just stopping the points per minute structure game for this arc. Because Ovi has to stop it too if they want to grab this arc. And they should. They should. Because they know from the first game, if 36 is grabbing at least one arc, Ovi has a risk to lose. And they, they, they for sure don't want this to happen. Yeah. We can see a lot of marches mobilizing. And if 36 would have been a little bit earlier here, if they would have been a little bit earlier here with a bigger group, they could have fired their skill earlier and al already push in. This is how you can do it. Get more troops than the opponent more early, fire the skills get the buffs going, attack and defense and get an advantage to smash those troops. Now 36 still getting some reinforcements to this position but they should fire their skill just right now and push in. Come on, fire the skill and push in. Because OV reinforcements are still coming and you are complete here, come on. Just a few coming. This is not important. This is not important. And Peter, what are you doing here? Come on, push forward. One minute and 40 seconds for the arc to spawn. Fire the skills and push in, 36. Come on, do it. The second arc, this is yours. Get your arc. Get it going. Damn, you have to get it. And war drums from 36. And we got... Defense, Mystical Formation from OV as a counter. And we also got Mystical Formation for 36. Are we going to see To The Death being casted by 36? If you want to fire To The Death, do it now. Now or never. This is the moment. You win it or you lose it. You win it or you lose it. And 40 seconds for the arc to spawn. This looks pretty good for 36. Look at the battle line. Look at the battle line. 36 is waiting here for the arc to spawn. And 36. Will you be able to sustain and not losing too many troops? Please. I don't want to see too many sad faces. Please. This time it has to work. And 15 seconds for the arc to spawn. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a, this is a situation they win or they lose. I don't think they can afford another push that early if they want to win the points per minute game. And a lot of sad faces from OV. This is good. Come on. And the Ark has spawned. OV captured it. No. Come on, kill it. Doctor Strange. Doctor Strange has the Ark. And 
And he lost it. And I can see more 36 marches in red over here. It looks good for 36. It looks good for 36. Come on, push more troops into the middle. You have to get this one. Musical formation from 36. That's good, that's good. Defense. Defense for 36. Now what they have to do, they have to take care of those uh, OV marches snacking on the carrier. And they have to deny marches coming from this side as a group. Because they have the defense advantage. And I still can see also war drums being casted here. Whoa, this is action. This is action, guys. And I can see 36 carrying the arc. Finally. Finally. So let's see if OV is starting to get some marches here at the corner because they could flank. They could flank, but looks like uh, that's no problem here. Let's check the points. 16,500 for OV and 16,900 for 36. That's just 300 points different. And this arc will give 3,000 500 points because this is the second arc it's always raising by 500 points and good job 36 yes to one you are correct now very important 36 keep your points per minute game running and chat have you seen to the death being casted i couldn't keep track on it i couldn't keep track on it have you seen to the death being casted already Frodo OG, welcome. And make sure to drop a like and subscribe. Very appreciated. 36. Got the arc. They have it. Finally. There it is. Killer B. You for sure are a hero. And uh, 36, you have to get your points per minute game running again. And OV for sure is crying now in uh, in Discord. Well, not crying, but uh, yelling and... Come on, guys! Come on, guys! We have to fix it! Pretty sure about that. Now, on the first match, we have seen... 36 only required one arc to win the match. And this time, they grabbed one arc. Does it mean 36 is going to get their point and win this match? We're gonna see, we're gonna see. Who knows? Maybe they still can get one more arc. OV is crying on Discord. <laughs> no, no, I haven't said it. Uh, I'm going to edit. Okay, I have to edit. I am a German, so my English skills are not the best ones. I mean yelling, not crying. Don't get me wrong on that. And we can see some OV marches going in for the Shrine of War, I believe. And meanwhile, we can take a look on other structures with our second device. We see a huge swarm on the Desert Altar from OV. Let's go into the split screen. And the Ark has not been delivered yet. But still, still 36 is leading by 700 points. And Insatiable Desire has been fired. Let me check about the details of this skill. Oh, this is interesting. OV fired Insettable Desire, which is giving an increase in caravan gathering speed of 50%. So OV tries to compensate the loss of this arc with a higher gather income. So 
Sky Alter has been captured by OV. 36, you have to get it back. But also the Sky Alter on the bottom side. Also being owned by OV. So I guess there will be a point of minute disruption for 36. Soon. Yeah, this was being expected because 36 had to send a lot of marches in the middle to grab this second arc. And OV are swarming, they are raging. They don't like the situation of the second arc. And let's check. The arc has not been delivered yet. Oh, this is interesting. Killer B is waiting. Killer B is waiting to deliver the arc. This is interesting and this can work. Because 36 is stronger in the points per minute game. Whoa. Whoa. This can be smart. So, we all know 36 is very great on the points per minute game. Are they just going to wait to deliver this arc till the end? While making sure... What are all those marches doing? Are they returning? Okay, they are low. Alright, got it. But structure-wise, it doesn't look good. It doesn't look good. Sky Altar being owned by OV. The other Sky Altar also being owned by OV. And Sky Altars are giving huge points. Huge points. 700 points for the first occupation. And... Uh, let me get the information for the points per minute. Yeah. The Altars are giving 150 per minute and the Shrines are giving 80. Which means Altars have twice the value. They have to get back their Altars. Otherwise their strategy may not work out. But I think... Uh, 36 can handle. They just need some minutes to get back into their points per minute game. But on the other side, I believe OV does know about this fact and uh, they're going to try to keep the structures. Going to try to keep it. Meanwhile, let's uh, check. No, let's keep our camera on this altar. Yeah, it's very important. Okay, got the second cam over here. Let's switch. And meanwhile, we put the other cam on this Sky Altar. Okay, the Sky Altar has been uh, captured back by 36th, finally. And the points for OV are 20,900 against 20,600. 300 points difference, that's not too much, but they have to get back this Desert Altar. And it's going to fall. 36, good job. They have both altars back. They found their way back into the points per minute game. And the arc still not being delivered. Killer B is just waiting here. He's just waiting. Meanwhile, the Shrine of War getting uh, some pressure here, but that's not enough. I can tell you Desert Alta being under attack from 36. As always, Zenobia in garrison. That's the default, that's the standard. And doesn't look uh, 36 can do over here. something over here. Shrine of War under a little bit pressure here, but uh, we're getting reinforcements from 36. And I can see 5 minutes for the arc, so this is their time limit when they have to deliver, I guess. Now, 
19, about 19 minutes for the game to last. Good strategy from 36 here. But OV leading by 1000 points. This can be a close one. Now again, this arc over here, 3500 points if it's getting delivered. And I see some pressure on this Desert Alta, but no problem for OV. Fracture Vice, Shrine of War is safe, secured. The Sky Altar. And we can see a Ramses Rally on the Shrine of Life from 36. They're getting some points over here. 25 minutes to go for occupation. Which will be 80 per minute. And the Ark still haven't been delivered fifteen unsubscribe from OV fans <laughs> I corrected I corrected chill relax and we're seeing some pressure here on the desert altar from 36 site but I can see a lot of 36 around, so they shouldn't have a problem reinforcing here. 17 minutes for the game to go, points-wise. OV managed to get some more points over here. 23,500 against 21,500. So OV leading by 2,000 points right now. This can be a close thing. Oh, this can be very close. Now, if the Ark has to be delivered in the next three minutes... Ah, Points-wise, it can be... Uh, it can be very risky. Can be a very close game here. Yeah. Very close. Now, if 36 can manage to get one more Ark... And I believe both... Alliances still have... Uh, to the death. To the death skill is a game-changer. Once uh, being fired, you're causing a lot of damage. Desert Altar has been secured by 36. But OV managed to get this Desert Altar on the top. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. This is points per minute disruption. That's bad. That's really bad. Now, a lot of changes to the points. Uh, the gatherers can bring but as we remembered OV fired their arc skill which was incitable desire giving uh, increase in caravan ca gather speed by 50% so OV's gathering points will be higher than 36 by a higher chance I believe And the Ark has been delivered, ladies and gentlemen. Which means, in about 7 minutes 40 seconds, the last Ark is going to spawn. And this will be a huge match. And I believe everyone is just sending everything. This will be the final last stand of this uh, Ark Osiris finals. And whoever is going to win this most likely will also be the winner. Now, after Slowly, Insatiable Desire again being fired by OV. And 36 trying to get back the Sky Altar.
Now, let's move the second cam into the middle. We want to see who is going to send marches there first. Okay, 36, you have to start sending marches into the middle. 36, you have to start sending marches into the middle. Now, because OV, as we can see here, is mobilizing. 36, send everything you have into the middle. Come on. OVs will try to get a group together, pushing to this location, and uh, then they're going to fire. And uh, Swift Stride has been fired. Which is 50% walking speed for all members. So, OV strategy here. Getting everyone into the middle as fast as possible. This skill has huge impact. And if OV is doing it right, they pushing to this zone. And denying 36 being able to touch the next arc. 36 and everything. This is the one and last stand. This is the one and last stand. Let's uh, keep our camera into the middle. This will be the most important scene right now. 36. Will you be able to get the next arc too? This is going to be interesting. I believe OV will be able to have a bigger group soon and they can fire a skill to kill all those small marches over there. I wanted to say, but finally we can see a swarm of marches heading to the middle. Group up, 36. Group up. And you have to send everything. This is not enough. Come on. This is not enough. Points wise, OV and 36 are kinda even. And OV, as I told you, most likely is going to try to push 36 to this location here. To the side of 36 so they have space to grab the arc once it's spawning. John Wick have focused too much to upload videos on YouTube instead of training with OV. I'm just reading the chat here. Hey, too bad if you bet on the underdog. Oh, nothing is done here yet. Nothing is done here yet. Nothing is done here yet. 3 minutes and 30 seconds to go. For my opinion, 36 started to gather their troops in the middle. Too late. Too late. But now, okay, everyone is mobilizing. Let's hope OV is not firing their skills now. Let's see uh, those marches coming in. Some last ones over here on the top. And some more here. Alright, I believe. Let's check the timer. 2 minutes, 30 seconds. And in about 10 seconds we're going to see the first skills being fired from OV and they're pushing in. How about this prediction? Let's see. Let's see about this prediction. And OV, go! Now or never. Now or never. Fire the skills and push in. Okay, they're still going to wait a little bit more for these marches to arrive. But that's enough. That's enough. OV, you, you make my prediction uh, not looking very well here. Please. There we go. John Wick, mystical formation, defense up. 80% defense. Correction, 50% defense. 
and war drums being casted from all sides here 36 and OV and let's see to the death should also be casted because this is the last arc they going to get here and yeah it's a little bit laggy here right now but uh, well this is my device and it broke we will be back very fast don't worry we have the second cam here And let's check back. Simplified graphics now, but that's fine. Now, what is funny is on the bottom right you can see it's nighttime, and on our main device it's daylight, whatever. This is the final fight. Let's check the sad faces. And 30 seconds to go to spawn for this arc, points wise. They are nearly the same, maybe three or four hundred. More points for OV right now. This arc is very crucial. Arc spawning in 15 seconds. And it looks pretty even over here. Still March is arriving to the middle. And the arc is spawning. Mystical formation being casted. And OV has captured the Ark. OV captured the Ark. Get him. No, guys. Don't let him run. Come on. Don't let him run. You have to push the fight more to the Ark. So you can more easy kill the Ark carriers. This is what you have to do here. And 36 captured the Ark. Fire the movement speed. Come on, fire the movement speed. Skill. And last. This looks like a very close game, but I have to say I can see a little bit more OV troops over here, but sad faces from OV here. So, kinda even, question mark. Do we see reinforcements here from 36? That's not enough. That's not enough. But OV also slowly going to reinforce. And this fight looks pretty even, I have to say. And our device also broke for the second one. It's crazy. <laughs> Everything is breaking here. Killer, welcome. And sad faces from OV over here. And OV captured the Ark. Kill him. Kill the Ark area 36. This is all in. Ark area has been killed. Yes. Good job. Now, troops wise, looks pretty even. Now it's all about reinforcements. Now it's all about reinforcements being sent into the middle. And smart use of skills, okay? If the arc carrier has an arc, you can fire the walking speed. Let him run as long as possible. 36 last control about the arc. 4 minutes 30 seconds to go for this finals. And 36 captured the arc. Go, 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 run. Come on, come on. Fire some movement skill. And the control has been last again. Points wise, 36 leading by 800, 900 points now. It looks good. Violent stand being launched by 36. Okay, violent stand is giving 50% defense to a structure. And OV captured the arc over here. And I have to say, I can see more and more marches in blue 
which uh, most likely means OV may be able to get this arc, but even if this is the case, 36 has to send all marches there to deny OV delivering this arc. If they cannot get the arc, deny OV getting the arc. They still can win. They still can win. Just deny OV grabbing this arc, delivering it to their structure. And uh, by the way, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. Very appreciated. If 36 is going to win this match, we're going to see a third finals game here. Three minutes left for this game. 36. Send as many troops as possible here into the middle to deny OV grabbing the arc and delivering it. Whatever happens, if you cannot, if you cannot get it here, send them at the sides. This uh, can work too. And OV is delivering the arc to their side. 36. Push forward and kill the arc area. Yes, push more. Come on. Everything. You have to deny OV delivering this arc. If OV is able to deliver it, it's going to be too risky. Too risky. John Wick has captured the arc. No. That's not the good news for 36. That's not the good news for 36. We know John Wick is a good runner and he lost control of the arc. Two minutes to go for this game. And points wise it looks even. OV same points like 36 now. And OV has captured the arc again. OV has captured the arc again. Still 36 marches heading into the middle. Looks good. This one looks good. This one looks very good. I don't believe OV will be able to deliver this thing. So, this is going to be very interesting. But, I have to say... OV fired two times a skill for improving gather speed. Insatiable desire. Two times increase caravan gather speed by 50%. This may have been a well choice for OV. Yeah, this arc is going nowhere, okay? This arc is going nowhere. And 36 leading by 2000 points now. That's good. Nice. Well done, 36. You can do it. You can do it. Gather us coming in now. Gather us returning back to home. 36 leading by 2400 points now. And this arc is going nowhere, I can tell you. Let's keep track on the score at the top. Yeah, it looks good for 36. 15 minutes to go. 41,238.4 for OV. If there is no magic. 36 is going to be the winner. Boom. Gratulations, 36. Well done. Well done. Very nice job. And OVP Nabani, most valuable player. And gratulations, 36. They learned from the first game. They have known they had to get one arc at least and they managed to grab the second arc for 3500 points. They did a smart strategy, they kept the arc till the last minute because they know they can lead the points per minute game on structures and they succeeded. Ladies and gentlemen, make sure to drop a like and subscribe because there will be one more finalist, a finals game which we are going to live cast. And this is for sure going to be interesting. The winner of the next finals will be the final winner. The champion. And again, gratulations to 36. Well done. Good job. Let's just compare. Occupation score. 25,200 from OV. And 28,200 from 36. This is a difference of 3,000 points. Well done. 
provision score pretty even. But remember, OV even fired 50% uh, Gaza speed skill. So without the skill, 36 did better on provision score. I would uh, say total kills more on OV side. Unit sealed. Well, you don't have to look at unit sealed because a lot of T1. Again, 36. Congratulations. Thanks everyone for joining. This was amazing and tension and uh, a very close game. A very close game. Now, have uh, a good rest of the day. And I see people asking for the name of the music. Now, here's a tip. I cannot always check for the, for the name, but you can install an application for your phone, which is called Shazam or Soundhunt. You can uh, check the video again, where there is a song you like, and just use your application to get the name of the song. This is what Shazam and other applications are for. This is a good tip. Also for other soundtracks you're going to find uh, good, just uh, use it. And yes, we won. We won our bet because we placed on 36. We're going to wait for this juicy coins to arrive. Oh yeah. 17,600 plus. Yeah. And what we can buy? Everything. We're going to buy the shop. Fully, complete, everything. Thank you very much, 36. I had trust in you and you delivered as uh, expected. Thanks everyone. Yeah, probably a lot of coins for everyone, as it is a well-known strategy to bet on the underdog. Chilkröte. Gerne. Alright, have a good rest of the day. Enjoy. And see you on the next one.